हाय वेलकम टू द फोर्थ लेक्चर ऑफ थर्मोडायनेमिक्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द पॉइंट एंथेल्पी नाउ सी द एंथेल्पी इज डिफाइंड एज एच इज इक्वल टू यू प्लस पी वी वी नो दैट यू इज इक्वल टू इंटरनल एनर्जी पी इज द प्रेशर ऑफ द सिस्टीम एंड वी इज इट्स वॉल्यूम सो यच इज इक्वल टू यू प्लस पी वी इट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ एंथेल्पी नाउ इन दिस इक्वेशन वन यू दैट इज इंटरनल एनर्जी पी दैट इज प्रेशर एंड वी दैट इज वॉल्यूम ऑल आर दी स्टेट फंक्शन देअर फोर एंथेल्पी इज ऑल्सो ए स्टेट फंक्शन ओके सो एंथेल्पी इज ऑल्सो ए स्टेट फंक्शन देअर फोर एज इट इज ए स्टेट फंक्शन the difference in enthalpy that is delta h we can write it as a h f minus h i where h i is the enthalpy of initial state while h f is the enthalpy of final state so delta h is equal to h f minus h i now see this is important point the change in enthalpy that is dh is equal to the energy supplied as heat at constant pressure provided the system does no additional work see suppose if we have a system okay now if we supply energy as a heat at constant pressure to that system what i have said suppose we have a system if we supply energy as heat at constant pressure to that system so that supplied heat is equal to the change in enthalpy so the change in enthalpy is equal to the energy supplied as heat at constant pressure but provided the system does no additional work so in the form of equation we can write dh is equal to dq so dh is the change in enthalpy and dq is the change in heat okay and for a measurable change we can write delta h is equal to qp so for a measurable change instead of dh we have to write delta h and instead of dq we have to write qp so from these equations 2a and 2b v can state that when a system is subjected to constant pressure and only expansion work can occur the change in enthalpy is equal to the energy supplied as heat what is the statement when a system is subjected to constant pressure and only expansion work can occur the change in enthalpy is equal to the energy supplied as heat okay now uh, let us try to understand this statement with the help of a simple example now see uh, this example is only for the purpose of purpose of understanding see suppose if we have an open beaker containing water so uh, when we take an open beaker containing water water at this time uh, pressure is constant now suppose that electric heater is immersed in that beaker now if we supply 36 kJ energy through this electric heater to the water what i have said if we supply 36 kJ energy through this electric heater to the water then according to our statement the change in enthalpy is 36 kJ the change in enthalpy of water is 36 kJ so what we have supplied we have supplied heat suppose in the form of heat that is 36 kJ okay so the change in enthalpy of water is 36 kJ so that what uh, we have stated when a system is subjected to constant pressure so here that an open beaker uh, which is at a constant pressure and only expansion work can occur the change in enthalpy so change in enthalpy is delta h of that water 
is equal to the energy supplied as heat so is equal to the energy supplied as heat so to this an open beaker we have supplied 36 kJ energy that result in the change in enthalpy of water which is again equal to the 36 kJ okay so this is about the uh, this statement so when we say enthalpy enthalpy is the heat change at constant pressure okay you have to remember though uh, we have uh, seen definition here that h is equal to u plus pv this is the definition of enthalpy but inverse what we have to say about enthalpy enthalpy is the change in heat at constant pressure that uh, we have described here okay so this is about the point enthalpy thank you